welcome or welcome back to my channel Rap to Fab. So how are you all? I hope all are doing great. So today's, I guess you can hear that sound going on because of the puja today. Here is chhat puja. I don't know how many of you know, but yeah, आगे मैं voice over करने वाली हूँ. Just bear for few minutes this. So this video is going to be on cut trees, this look right here, and also wedding guest look. So if you like this, please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And also before starting, let me tell you that I'm not a pro in doing cut creases, guys. It takes a lot of practice and efforts, and I totally get it. If you are not like pakka uh, pakka nahi ho pa raha hai exactly, so it's okay. Keep on practicing and follow the steps that I'm going to share today. I know many of you know the tricks because बहुत पुराना हो चुका है cut crease, but That's completely fine. I'm doing it for the first time. Now, without more, let's get started. Maybelline Fit Me Foundation in the shade Natural Buff, and I've already moisturized my face using Pond's moisturizer. And after that, I'm going to blend this out using a dab beauty sponge. Eli Pro concealer in the shade Pure Beige to hide my dark spots. to highlight further i'm using second layer of concealer which is from maybelline fit me in the shade sand sable And again I'm just going to blend this out. Now I'm using Maybelline Fit Me loose powder in the shade light 15 to bake my face and I will let it bake for 2 minutes. And now after dusting off the excess I'm moving on to face contouring I'm using master contour palette and taking that bronzer shade and applying it Just take your time and enjoy the process. So up next, I'm moving on to blush. For blush today, I'm going to use a lipstick and a blush. So the lipstick is from Nykaa Liquid Lipstick in the shade Delhi, and the blush is from Biotic in the shade Coral. So first, I'm applying the lipstick, blending it out with the same dab sponge, and after that, I'm going to set this out with the blush. Next is highlighter from Wet n Wild in the shade Precious Petals.
and now finally the face makeup is done now moving on to eye makeup for that i'm using wet n wild eyeshadow in the shade rose in the air and now i'm going to take that mustard shade for my grease and my yahan pe ek bahut patla sa tapered brush use kar rahi hu so that eyeshadow precisely wahi apply ho so i'm just carving out the line and next i'm using a fluffy blending brush एंड आपको पेन ब्रश आई मीन ऊपर से होल्ड नहीं करना है नीचे से करना है सो दैट वो वहीं पे प्लेस होगा एग्जैक्टली नेक्स्ट टाइम टेकिंग दैट डार्कर ब्राउन शेड एंड यूजिंग अनदर टेपर डेंस ब्रश अगेन शॉर्ट ब्रश है आप फिंगर्स के हेल्प से भी इसे यूज कर सकते हो एंड आई एम जस्ट प्लेसिंग इट इन माई आउटर कॉर्नर्स एंड आई एम नॉट गोइंग मच आउटर साइड आई एम जस्ट कीपिंग इट वेर इट इज एंड नेक्स्ट ब्लेंड आउट इन अ स्क्रैचिंग वे एंड नॉट इन अ सर्कुलर वे So now once you are satisfied with the blending and the pigmentation moving on to the next shade from the palette that is the pink shade and I'm using it with my finger just placing it at the center of my eyelid the way you are seeing exactly like that it's done now take your time just be calm and the main part is going to come soon so here comes the main musibat cut crease so for that I'm using the same concealer from Maybelline and all i'm doing is placing a little bit of concealer on my hand and with the help of a flat very flat brush this is from vega in case you want to know this is from vega and i'm just taking some of the concealer on it and placing a dot on the center of my eyelid very close to the lash line just a dot like that and then bas aapko apne eyes ko aise upar flick karna hai just like that watch up and flick it up you can see two dots right there yes that is the border jisko aapko paar nahi karna hai wahi tak aapko aapki cut crease uh, concealer se cut karni hai now be very calm and take your time it's not so easy go slow for me also it's not easy just take your time and now fill the gaps jitni bhi jagah hai wo dono dots ke beech mein just fill the gaps half way and we are done our half cut crease is almost ready now going back to the same eye shadow palette i'm taking that orange shade with the help of my fingers again placing it uh, outer corner se thoda sa like inner corner ke side mein basically center se thoda sa outer side ke beech mein i hope you get it so i'm just going to pack this color that orange shade and again in a scratching way not in a circular way just pack it on and blend it nicely next i'm taking that pink shade and using my fingers and placing that on the center of the eyelid basically thoda sa inner eye corner ke se close hoga wo and we are almost there next to add some fun part i'm using the glitter shade from the palette and also i will be using a glitter eye shadow later so i'm just taking that eye shadow and placing it on my inner eye corners we are almost done and now for the lash line i'm using the same shades that is the pink brown and that mustard shade and next i'm using swiss beauty glitter eye shadow in the shade diamond uh, i think so diamond dust uska naam hai main description mein de dungi so i'm using an eyeliner brush and creating a very very thin line on that curve be very careful while doing this warna aapka pura shade ye spoil ho jayega and i need the mirror very close while doing this i was scared too so just like that slowly just create a very thin eyeliner over there and we are done and lastly i'm using mascara from maybelline and the name is hypercul I hope it was clear to you how to create half cut crease kuch to samajh aaya hi hoga please give a thumbs up and with that we are done with our look and lastly to complete the whole makeup look i am just using the same highlighter and highlighting my inner eye corner and under my brows and next using a liquid lipstick from Nykaa in the shade Bombay and yes before that i'm just taking that darker brown shade once again on a very small tapered brush and creating a depth on that line so that it gives you more illusion of that cut crease look see that it's creating a depth over there which is very nice so tada finally we are all set for our wedding guest look you can also call it evening gown look so with that we are done
for today's video. I hope you like my take on this wedding look cut crease tutorial. And if it was somewhat helpful you, please guys do not forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are new here. And I will see you in my next video. Until then, bye. Take care and keep glowing.